something we should think about. The people that we love and care for, we need to be bringing them flowers and spending the time with them today. So let's segue into the rant part of it. All right. The other day or a while back, my wife signs me up for this wonder list. She puts it on my phone, you know, and I, I guess I didn't really think anything about it. Um, so last week, she, uh, sorry, there was a bald eagle up there. Uh, last week they had, uh, ah, crap. What was I saying? Distracted by a bald eagle. Oh, so anyway, so last week I was home by myself for a little bit, which is like our super rarity. And I was like, you know what? I remember her mentioning something about a list. Cause she said, did you check the list for the stuff that I asked you to do? And I was like, what list? And she's talking about this app she put on my phone a month ago. So she's gone, I was like, all right, I'll check out this list. So I looked at it and I mean, they were things that weren't difficult. That's not, the point is, I thought, is that where we've become? You know, again, segue, segueing from, we never visit people, um, you know, while they're alive, but we do it when they're dead. Um, to me, these things like wonder lists and when you're just, all you ever do is pri or message people on Facebook, uh, send them text messages, maybe tag them in a post. And now they have a list, a wonder list. Hey, guess what? I don't even have to talk to my wife for a honey-do list anymore. Just check the app. You know, so basically we don't need to have any form of human um, interaction whatsoever. We might as well be like that movie Surrogates where everybody's just hooked up to a machine and live in some fantasy world, never talking to each other in person. With most people living their lives through their surrogate selves, our world has become a safer place. Take a seat in your STEM chair, and just with the power of your mind, you can control your surrogate and send it out into the real world. That's what we're doing. These cell phones, and all these other ways that we're communicating and talking to people, you might as well just call them the robots. It ain't gonna be long before it's just like surrogates. Bark it. That's what's gonna happen. Talk to a human being. Put down your phone and talk to somebody. 